news just in. The government has suspended any wild coin activities in the country. What kind of confusions? On Wednesday, Interior CS Kithure Kindiki said the state had also suspended any other entity that may be similarly engaging Kenya. Kindiki noted that the government is concerned by the ongoing activities of an organization calling itself Wildcoin, which is involved in the registration of Kenyans through the collection of eyeball iris data. <laughs> The registration exercise for Wildcoin at the Kenyatta International Convention Center yesterday was stopped, that is on Tuesday, uh, over security concerns. And then uh, later on, hundreds of Kenyans turned up for the registration uh, at uh, on Wednesday at uh, Kasarani Stadium, where they were also turned away. <laughs> The CES has also revealed that relevant security, financial services and protection agencies have commenced inquiries and investigations to establish the authenticity and legality of the Air Force. <laughs> of the safety and protection of the data being harvested and how the harvesters intend to use the data is being looked at, he said. For public safety, the CES say the integrity of the financial transactions involving such a large number of citizens must be satisfactorily uh, provided up. <laughs> Sensation. In addition, this is what you need to know. The government has warned of any entity or person intending to undertake such an activity. This is as quoted, appropriate action will be taken on any natural or juristic person who further aids a <laughs> engages minor is connected with the activities afford this. Freedom is coming tomorrow. <laughs> that is now illegal, it has been suspended. Don't be engaged in it until the, when the government it releases that information. Adios, Mose. Don't forget to follow me. It's your boy, Royal Mikansa Regi for more trending news. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. <laughs>